At 87 square kilometers, the island of St. Martin is the smallest landmass in the world that's shared by two different nations. Both France and the Netherlands own this island, and you can see the influence of both cultures everywhere. The quaint town of Marigot is the cultural center for French St. Martin. Both the French and Caribbean cultures create a unique blend of business and pleasure. Marigot is a very old town. It was founded in the beginning of the 18th century. And what are some examples of French influence we'll find here? The road signs, they look exactly like in France, and you will find products that are typically French. We have foie gras, we have uh, also many restaurants. Many? He's not kidding. The French influence is wonderfully obvious in the restaurants and bakeries. It's like a Parisian bakery in a tropical place. Best of both worlds. For a sense of history, as well as the very best views of the island, there's Fort San Louis. Are you seeing this? Amazing. Hey, I earned this. Right now, I am standing in two places at once, right on the border of the Dutch side and the French side. No security, no customs, no problems for over 365 years. The Dutch counterpart to Marigot is Philipsburg, and you can see the Dutch influence in the stunning architecture. It's a lively port with white sand beaches and lots of shopping. The influence of French and Dutch, a mix of European flair and tropical Caribbean paradise. It makes St. Martin the biggest little island in the world. For more information, visit westjetvacations.com or call your travel agent.